on that particular day when we found the Dornier, we'd um, already just gone into the water to have a look at one obstruction, which just turned out to be um, a lump of timber, maybe from something from a, a warship um, during a 1700 storm, something, um, something like that. As I got ready for the second dive, got all my bits and pieces together, got in the water, went down the shot line, I come across um, literally into a uh, hollow of an aeroplane. Uh, the visibility wasn't good, um, there was nets all around the wreck, um, generally caught from uh, fishermen over the years, trawl nets and different bits and pieces all around it. Um, over the next few weeks, days and weeks, we uh, cleaned off the uh, netting, um, freed up the engine so we could get a better description of the engines. You have to figure out what you're diving because of the conditions that are down there. And then we had uh, one very good day where we could literally see the whole aircraft sitting upside down on the seabed. It was phenomenal, it was brilliant. To be the first person to actually find something like this that has been lost for so long and to realise that you are the first person to find it is it's quite an achievement. It um, does give you a bit of a buzz. Um, it's exciting and I guess that's what keeps us diving. Um, you have to look on the good side of things that yes we've found it. Unfortunately, a lot of people would never have seen it until now, which is very good because it gives the people around the world really sort of like information that they can actually look at this massive object. Be it a war, a war horse as such, it's still something that's very exciting and it's very good for our own historic importance, really. It was a fantastic. Um, thing to see actually, I mean obviously I was a very young kid when we saw the Mary Rose but this is almost your own Mary Rose because diving something then to be the first person to actually see the wreck and then see it come out of the water to be on site when it was coming out of the water was phenomenal. Um, quite touching in a way just to see it rise from the water like it did, it was uh, not something you see every day.